Hello, it's Jason Payne with JDP Realty Group, a coal banker, Dan Hop Realtors. Well, I'm at the Grove section of Vintage Oaks in New Braunfels, and I'm doing another follow-up tour for a client who's getting a beautiful home built in this section. This house is being built by Monticello, and it is Dearborn plan. Let's go check it out. The weather's finally stopped raining here in Texas, so it's time to catch up on some of my video tours I owe my clients. But uh, I love this location in the Grove, um, right uh just the next block over is the fitness center that's going to have the lap pool uh all the whole gym area walking trails this can be a beautiful home let's go check out the inside i do see there's workers inside there so i'll try to respect their privacy all right before we go inside let's take a look at what the septic actually looks like this is an aerobic septic it is a hybrid because they do have a water treatment plant here out just outside the grove section and a water spray off area located in a different location. All right, let's go check out the inside of this house. All right, like I said, we do have some workers in here, but luckily there's no saw noise. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to knock this video out. All right, I'm gonna come in. You got a little zigzag in the entryway, but really wide entry. You come in, you are gonna have a mud room right next to the garage and the utility room. On the other side of the entry, you have this beautiful space for the office. Tell my client has gone with the upgraded can lighting in there because she is going to be working from home. But just off the office space is going to be a guest bedroom. A nice size closet in the guest bedroom. office space again there is going to be a shared bathroom which we got somebody working in howdy and then the other bedroom i'm trying not to interfere with the workers but this bedroom is going to have an even bigger closet oops excuse me all right that's the front part of the house but we also have a big formal dining room or flex space, whatever you want to use this space for. Or this could be the office and that center space could be a different flex space. So lots of options with the Dearborn plan. This plan is almost 2,300 square feet. And before you guys start asking me what the prices are, I will post the price list for this plan as of late May 2021. Prices have changed a lot in the last six months, so be aware of that. Well, my client picked out some beautiful granite. It's gonna be hard to see, it's gonna be better. They've got a protective covering on it right now, so it doesn't show its true colors, but a nice deep. Oh, she's got the super upgrades. She put a lot of upgrades in this house. And I can't wait to see what it all turns out looking like. There's a better look at the granite or the quartz. I believe that is quartz. But cabinets are in. They're putting the finishing touches on them. It's going to have the built-in oven and built-in microwave. Good size pantry. kind of tough to see how the flooring is going to look because they've got so many coverings on it and all of this it's a construction zone right now they are going to get it all super cleaned up for you beforehand but built-ins above the refrigerator and it's going to have some great lighting in this house lots lots and lots of can lighting in here and you can see where they're going to have it primed for the pendulant lighting as well. The backyard, there's going to be a little bonus space in this backyard because the property kind of goes from where the corner of that wood fence is to that other wood fence. But then you got this nice little wedge that's going to be. Uh, open i still haven't got confirmation whether it's going to be a wrought iron fence or a wood fence 
I would think it would be wrought iron because the fence behind it has a wrought iron. But I need to clarify that with the sales rep because that wrought iron fence would really make this place really feel much more open. But a beautiful oak tree just on the edge of the property line. All right, I can get a better a total view of the kitchen area. Gonna have a powder room right off the main living space. And then into the owner suite. They do have lots and lots of windows in here with an extra knockout. Tall ceilings with, once again, extra can lighting. So lighting is not gonna be a problem in this house. All right, let's go check out this bathroom because I know my client is interested to see how her design choices are turning out. Got some beautiful white countertops and you can see the shower. It's gonna have the same tile that's on the floor. That's gonna be absolutely lovely. With a nice can light right above it. This is gonna be the, I believe, bathtub area. They just haven't put it in just yet. We are about two months away from this house being completed. Your powder room, your water closet right there. And then, okay, yeah, no power in here yet. Gonna have uh, lots of closet space. Your long dress spot, two rows, plenty of place spots for shoes, and then the rest of the closet space. And once again, nice eight foot doors. Loving the eight foot doors in these houses. Let's see if we can see down here so you can see what the kind of little peak at what. There we go. It's going to look really nice. Main finals uh, look at the house, the main living area anyways. All right, that's going to wrap up the video tour of the Dearborn plan being built by Monticello in the Grove section of Vintage Oaks. I hope you found this video tour informative and there will be another one prior to you coming here and closing on this house. So it's coming along nicely. I'm excited to see how it turns out. All right, as always, if you're looking, if the general public watching this, make sure you like and subscribe and keep sharing these videos. All right, talk to you soon. Take care. Bye.